If he feels like it, he certainly could. But here we go. Hat versus Seabass. Hat does a lot of side Bs. I can't wait for Seabass to catch on. And just like, I'll be him for it. Okay, I think I think Hat's Falcon is good. I like his I like his Falcon. It's definitely a good a viable option against uh, against Seabass. What? That's an appropriate face. Okay. I think Hat's definitely... He's trying to hit Seabass a little bit too much. Easiest way to win is Falcon in this matchup is just wait. Luigi's movement is more committal than yours. Dang, he took... He just took SIV. <laughs> Not dead for it, but... uh. I like that Nair, actually. You gotta you gotta show early enough that you're willing to do that. You're willing to get back on that stage. I'm not a Luigi player. I would have gotten I would have made a, a, a huge face if I was a Falcon player getting hit by that. That looked uh, that hitbox was definitely more behind him than I thought Luigi's fair got. That was a good DI on that fireball. Even at zero, he made it back on the stage. Oh, he did. He, <laughs> he did the da the dash tag grab. All the all the Mario Bros have their their uh, sounds for their dash tags. Play frame one. So if you do the dash tag cancel grab, then you get the, you get an extra Wahoo in there. <laughs> I actually I love that the Mario Bros are so loud. When they get up attack, also they they do their wah immediately. You can you can hear it as soon as like they're 150 or something. They go wah, and then takes them like a full second and a half to get up from ledge. All right, plenty of times Falcon is onga bonga hit buttons. That was one time when you need some you need some some finesse in hitting your buttons. When Hat got that first up air, he could have immediately turned around and gotten another up air. But that's, that's hard. It combos, but it's it's one of the harder things that Falcon has to do to get good punishes. Dang, downward, angled, forward smash, always ledge. It's Falcon, always go to ledge until they prove to you. That's really got in his face with that one. Uh, that's kind of unfortunate. I had the, I had the feeling if Hat could have activated his side B, he would be able to beat that out. But he got kind of a little bit unlucky. That's, that's the real buff that Falcon Falcon mains want. I want to be able to activate side B. I don't need no activation hitbox. Don't give me that nonsense. Clean there from Seabass. Seabass has got a long way to go if he wants to win this whole thing. But uh It'll be it'll be a hot minute. And yeah, we'll probably we'll probably get some character switches from Hat. It's looking like he's gonna try Sheik. Would not be super surprised if he stayed Sheik the whole time from here on out. But uh I like that he tried the Falcon. I'm so greedy. Every time I see Hat refresh ledge like that and Seabass 
is doing literally anything, I'm like, I'll just bear him. I would be greedy enough to probably get burned for it a couple times, but yeah, I would I would go for the immediate bear almost every time I refresh. Okay, I said immediate bear after you refresh. That's not what I meant. Not exactly. See, that was a little bit close, so it was that was harder. The idea was that a pivot jet? Am I just going crazy? Oh my bad. I did not change the title. This is not losers finals. This is grand finals. This is the last match. The last set or two, at least. Oh, the the spacing, the spacing on that back here, and then the B. That's nice. The amount of down smashes. That was some clean movement from Seabass. He's gotta, <laughs> you gotta get that grab. Too clean. Just moving too much. That back here. I want that back here every time. It worked out kind of rough because Seabass, I guess, he was already pretty close. Oh, I like that. She gets to work pretty hard. She's got to do a bunch of two hit combos. She doesn't have too much that combos long, long form like a bunch of up airs from Falcon does. But that's that's definitely a high percent choice. Is a weak back here, fair. Get to work with what you got. I feel like that same situation. You hit a fair, see bass holds down. And then Hat tries to follow. I feel like Hat has not gotten enough off of Seabass holding down and not teching. He got the you got the stock there after like another interaction, but yeah, even even that Hat didn't need to full hop, but because he full hopped, he got punished. Like even even trying for that two hit combo was a little bit too much. Here, I would drop down and back here immediately. Like, every time, rising back here. I feel like that covers what Seabass likes to do. Oh, he didn't, he didn't tech. Ooh. A little bit of a rough exchange at the end. Hat's probably, yeah, he's reeling a little bit. Falco on Yoshi's. That is a choice. Hats Falco's not bad. If we're being real, he's played the game a really long time, and I don't I don't think it's I don't think it's like disrespectful or anything to say he's probably the best Falco in the room, just because he's he played a long time. Doesn't matter if it's his main or not. At least currently. We have a couple Falcos. Bobby. Probably Vikram. But uh, they're not here today. I kind of wish that back throw did more. Not more percent, just more like I want. It, I want it to be useful. I want it to be a kill throw, maybe. I don't know. If, I don't know what the ramifications of that would be, but I think it'd be interesting to have a couple more proper kill throws in this game. And if they're weak. They could do something. That's probably not what they need. But <laughs> I mean, it's definitely not what they need. It's one of those buffs where you're just like. There would, I would need to think a lot more about whether that would 
make any sense whatsoever. I like that choice of the of the fair. Like it's techable, but it's that's so it's such a weird thing, right? Ha happen to get around it, but Okay. Yeah. I was gonna say good DI, he still lives. That's alright. Had took his hand a little bit off the controller. And then had to had to remember he's still playing the game. Cancel means that Hat couldn't get off his uh, his up tilt. He's eaten percent for it. Another missed L cancel. That was a good angle. I feel like that's the angle that Seabass usually covers, though. I feel like Seabass did not go as high as he usually does. He's not going to get the edge cancel, so it should be big percent. Or 8%. 8%. A combo. Alright, big brain should upbeat. Should upbeat to punish that. Uh. That's all. Good down tilt. Down tilt, definitely a good choice for killing the Mario Bros. They're at the right weight for it. You can kill at like 120 something instead of fishing for other stuff. Another big punish opportunity. The kind of lazy side beyond the stage. Good chase. Flexi like has gotta believe in himself a little bit more. I feel like that was that was a Hail Mary up B. He doesn't He doesn't need that just yet. And you definitely can't let Hat win with Falco. Alright, he's going back, Falcon. Maybe. He's thinking hard about it. FD. FD and he decided Falcon was his best choice. I think that makes sense. I guess. You don't want to you don't want to be chic, that's for sure. Falco also pretty dangerous. The throw combos that uh that you get are a lot. A lot more dangerous. Versus Falcon and versus uh, Falcon, I guess. That might kill him, even though, yeah. It took a lot of percent for it, but sometimes taking the hit just kind of works. Dang, was that a pivot grab? From C base? Always ledge. It's always ledge. It's always ledge, and C base decided to cover it with an up B. <laughs> I think that shows you where he's at right now. I like the air dodge down. But that seems more more frustrated than I would expect from him. He's, he's doing fine in this game. Right there, I'd probably still run up crouch, even though I don't really know what you're supposed to do on a grab if that's the punish you get if they roll, you know? My brain just likes certain options way more, I guess. When I'm watching Hat, I just expect... I expect certain things from the Green Falcon. That is an option to catch really long wave dashes from Luigi. You could side B. He has to be on the ground. It's not a good option. It's an option. Taking that fireball is actually very useful. Taking that fireball, like let him live, basically. Yeah, he got that. He got that at first in snub air, but the, the rest of our heart. It is unga bunga, but you gotta you gotta hit him. Your instant uppers on punishes. Your dash instant uppers, even. 
was a, a bold, bold attempt, but I, I mean, you know. He is, he is up. He's definitely feeling himself. This is, not gonna lie, probably Hat's victory lap. Unless Seabass turns it up and stops up being. Or stops, like, missing his upbeats. He's generally pretty good about hitting him, but it's been... It's been not the best. <laughs> the side beasts have gotten unpunished, basically. Jab. So I think you can still get um, re-grab as Luigi at this point. Yeah, or, or up tilt. Up tilt again, maybe. Up smash. So that was a good combo. You need, need a bunch of those, though, if you're going to make it back. So you guys are definitely moving. That was definitely what, uh, what he needed to start this out. You know, sometimes it does just end like that. Just a just a single big boy knee. <laughs>